Well, as you can see, um, just a little while ago, we found our homicide suspect hiding in a crawl space underneath that residence. Um, he became combative with the SWAT officers. Um, he was physically taken into custody. Um, we had a dog nearby. The dog was not deployed. That's my understanding. However, the dog was there just in case if the dog was needed. Um, he was determined. Um, we had received information that uh, he was not going to surrender, give himself up alive. Um, as you can see, uh, we've used every possible resource and strategy to try to get him to surrender peacefully. Um, however, we had to physically take him out. Um, based on the totality of the circumstances, as you can see, we needed to take every precaution that we did. People that we brought outside of the house earlier, Mark, I'm fine. Um, we interviewed them in an attempt to find out who, actually, who else was actually inside the residence and I'm being told that they were not cooperative in helping this. As you can see, we're still investigating this. Um, so until we have an opportunity to interview him and see how cooperative he is, um, maybe we'll learn a little bit more. The suspect, he was in the crawl space under the house. They, they've searched him um, and they took him off and he's on his way to the jail. Um, determined to be a marijuana grow ripoff and um, he's one of four that we've so far that we've arrested in this case. There may be more, I'm not sure. We'll have to see how this unfolds.